process of searching for the next school for my daughter was extremely difficult. I was kind of lost and I was given the name of two more schools. Benway School was one of them. No one had heard of it in my small circle. I called up the school, um, was lucky enough to get Mr. Carline on the phone. He spent about 45 minutes with me. I was in tears, he didn't know that, um, because the other school that wouldn't take my child, um, they also said to her kind of, um, what's, what's your problem? And they were really looking at her as a problem kid rather than a kid who um, is fresh, starting new, and would, would benefit from a new program. Mr. Carline um, answered my questions, made an appointment for me, and um, I came in alone last summer. They gave me the tour, sat down, talked to me, were really patient, and um, then a few weeks later brought my daughter back and hesitantly, because she didn't want to go to any school, she agreed to try Benway School. Um, but what I want to tell parents, um, rather than um, asking my daughter about her previous residential placement or what issues actually were troubling her either before or currently, what Mr. Carline did was something that I think was incredible. He said to her, um, tell me what you like to do. Tell me what you're doing now. And she started telling him about her job. And he said, um, would you like to do a work study program? And she said, what does that mean? And he said, well, that would mean that you wouldn't go to school as much, but you'd get to continue the work that you're doing. Um, and we could have that fit into your schedule. And her whole demeanor changed. Her face lit up. And I think she thought, not only is this man listening to me and hearing me, but this is someone who truly is trying to get me. And sure enough, um, Benway School was able to work with her employer and arrange and organize a program that would meet her educational needs as well as giving her the ability to continue the work that she's loved. Um, as a parent and as a teacher, what I'd like to tell parents is, even if your search is going to be done yourself without the help of other people, really um, don't choose the first school that might be recommended to you. Really look to try to match your child and where they are to an atmosphere that's open, welcoming, showing respect, and might not have the therapeutic um, elements that some of these other places have, but in reality, they have them all. What, what I said to Ms. Bourne was, you don't say that you have a family therapy program, but in reality, you've been responsive every time I've called the school to question or ask um, information or provide information about my kid. So isn't that a family program if you're responsive? Um, Julia is speaking to her counselor whenever it's necessary. That You say that it's once a week, it's been more than once a week. So what I want parents to realize is that some of these schools might present a structure and um, your kid might not really need that structure. You wanna look for a school that is open to structuring a program around what your child needs. And you might not realize that until they get there, but this school is completely ready, willing, and able to do just that.